Natural disasters are fast becoming the world's new reality. The scientific community is predicting even more frequent occurrences of tempests, storms and cyclones, acute droughts, epidemics and forest fires as a direct result of global warming. The idea of ECODRR or Ecosystem-Based Disaster Risk Reduction has evolved from the time-tested principle that ecosystem-based interventions are best suited for mitigating the impact of natural disasters both in the short as well as long term. ECODRR is aimed at people-centric disaster risk management which utilizes the strength of local communities and institutions as well as safety mechanisms inherent in natural landscapes and biodiversity. ECODRR thereby aims to build societies that are resilient and equipped to deal with disasters, thereby bringing a more holistic approach to the idea of disaster risk management. There is an urgent need for mainstreaming ECODRR by incorporating it in developmental activities and policy frameworks at the national, regional and community levels. India's Mahatma Gandhi National Rural Employment Guarantee Scheme and Kerala's own Ayankali Urban Employment Guarantee Scheme provide financial security through assured job opportunities to the vulnerable sections of society. What is less than known is that these jobs are geared towards creating sustainable and productive assets at the grassroots level. Therefore, the principle of ECODRR is at the core of the various activities that are being undertaken through the employment guarantee schemes across India today. And the potential for mainstreaming ECODRR through them is manifold. Moreover, ECODRR will strengthen the country's efforts in achieving the Sustainable Development Goals or SDGs put forth by the United Nations at the global level. In India, ECODRR can be effectively implemented by introducing more scientifically proven methods for the various works that are carried out under the Employment Guarantee Scheme, such as the construction of rain pits, farm ponds etc. for rainwater harvesting, planting vetiver and other grasses for preventing soil erosion, mangrove cultivation for shoreline protection among others. ECODRR further strives for women empowerment by placing them at the center of developmental activities. ECODRR also aids in enhancing local livelihoods by putting into practice local wisdom and by making use of locally available resources. Due to all this and more, ECODRR presents the best option for sustainable and holistic development and for preserving our environment and our future through a deeper understanding of nature and its processes.